On one side of the street, they were closing the book on the old Kern Memorial Library building. Well, on the other side, they were opening a new chapter from its past. Let's get on the other side. There you go. This time capsule was buried during construction of the library and found by workers tearing it down to make way for Norfolk's light rail system. And to some future generation. Norfolk City Councilman Randy Wright opened the time capsule and read a letter from F.W. Fred Duckworth, Norfolk's mayor in 1962. It is a privilege to inscribe this letter to be placed in the cornerstone of the Elizabeth and Henry Kern Memorial Library on this, the day of its dedication, May 18, 1962. Along with that letter, there were magazines, pamphlets, and this newspaper article touting Norfolk being named an All-America City. All-American City seal that the city got for 1959. City historian Peggy McPhillips is excited to see this point in time of her city's history. It really tells us what they wanted us to know about the library in the city in 1962 and the things that they were proud of then. Councilman Wright was amazed at how much it cost to run the city in 1962. 46 million 242,482 dollars and 62 cents. Right now we're over a billion dollars. So even I'd though it showed how much more it cost to live in today's Norfolk, to the people watching the opening of this time capsule, the memories revealed are priceless. In Norfolk, Mike Aiken, 10 on your side. Million, according to the uh, 